I have to say, when the government was first talking about this, and they were talking about merely extending the present uh, level of, of lockdown for somewhat longer in Leicester, uh, I have to say, I was saying, well, you know, why would you do that? Uh, because, you know, if the virus is spreading in Leicester under the present uh, level of restriction, uh, why would you expect it suddenly to stop if you just continued it for a couple of weeks? Um, I was very pleased that they actually uh, recognised that that wasn't going to be adequate, that if there were issues here in Leicester, uh, they needed to uh, require some dramatic intervention and not a continuation of the status quo. I'm very, very concerned, obviously, about the impact on the well-being of the city in general and the health of the people in the city, but also about the economy of the city. And one of the things we've been stressing to the government over recent times is that uh, if Leicester is to be locked down and its economy in, put on uh, in limbo for uh, a little longer, uh, we will need the support uh, that has given, was given earlier in the pandemic throughout the UK, uh, restored here in Leicester and maintained here in Leicester so that uh, our economy doesn't suffer from what is happening to the health of, uh, of our people.